Imagine this is you. Every time you play Fortnite, you do a lot of actions that you don't even realize. You jump, run, swing your pickaxe, and do all sorts of things. Everything you do needs to be sent to the server and then processed. After they're processed, the server sends you back packets showing that you move. These chunks of data of sending and receiving are called packets. So you may be wondering why when you have packet loss, you start teleporting. Well, it's kind of simple. Imagine you're trying to go forward and you're telling the server, I want to move forward. Usually the server receives it and sends it back to you. But sometimes when you have packet loss, sending a packet takes way too long. And usually what happens when you send an old packet and a new packet at the same time, you start teleporting. So can you do anything about this? Yes, kinda. Most of the time I would recommend you to just wait for a few hours or a few days. Usually your router or the Fortnite server is getting too many requests at the same time and you can't really fix that issue. But there are a few tips that actually help people and I think you should try it. Okay, I'll be honest, the first fix is really random but for some reason it works most of the time. Okay, so you want to go to the internet and write ultimate performance cmd and you usually want to copy this power config right here but if it doesn't show for you you can go a little bit down find major geeks scroll a little bit until you see this power config now you want to go to windows search bar and write cmd and make sure to run it as administrator okay now you just want to paste in what you copied and press enter now you want to go to windows search bar again and write edit power plan and now on the top you want to click on power options and make sure it says ultimate performance i don't know why but this usually helps a lot of people and it definitely has helped me in the past at least three times so i definitely recommend for all of you to try this what could you also try is changing your dns which helps some of the times personally it did help me once but it's not a very consistent method also there's this tool called tcp optimizer that helped me a lot of times in the past it's very good for your ping and also minimizing packet loss it has saved me at least three times in the past this is how it looks like i know it looks very old but it definitely helps and i do recommend that you would just search tcp optimizer download and the official guy who did it is speed guide and this is how the website looks like and if you want to know the best settings for tcp i would recommend that you would watch this video